Hi guys, so welcome back to the channel. It is absolutely tipping it down outside. So we was going to do a actual like fitting review of other products under the bonnet. But unfortunately, yeah, yeah I'll just show you. It's raining. And yeah, I'm not prepared to sit out in the rain when we've not got a garage or any cover at all. It's just not worth it. So today we're doing the interior mod ish. Well, basically, um, Reese is going to fit a quick shift. Well, we're doing it together. Definitely. I'm going to take pride and joy into this. Yeah. So we're going to we're going to fit that, and then so basically just a fitting video of the cheapest mod. Well, one of the cheapest mods you can get for the Focus RS, the most useful and obviously the most used, because um, obviously you use it every single day if you drive it every day. But yeah, so we're going to get onto it right now, and we're going to do it. So this is a how-to fitting kind of video, um, ish. Yeah. Mm -hmm. <laughs> okay. Um, right, so Reese, starting off, Reese has already took off the case and the cover and obviously the knob off it. Um, second thing he did was once it was all off, he basically just popped it off. It was really easy. Second thing he did was remove this, so this here yes. with a screwdriver. Um, it was a bit awkward, obviously, so we didn't really record that bit. But yeah, if you put a screwdriver underneath it, it should just pop off. But you might have trouble because we did. Don't. What we did is when it was on like this. We were trying to prise it. If you try and wedge it in between there and almost use the flathead to pivot it off, it works a lot. It will come off. Yeah. So now it's off, right? So this is now on to set three. Two. Why? Casing one. Casing's not really a step, is it? Okay, we're on step two. two. <laughs> what Reese is doing now is popping something out. <laughs> it's popping the thing you already popped off. There you go. Yep, so. What would you actually call that? Linkage, gear linkage. Right, so that's your gear linkage and he's popped it out so it's like really loose now. Can you see? Yeah. Yep, there, out. There. So it's like, yeah, right at the back. You can't really see it, but it's pretty awkward to get on record, but yeah, there, a little bit there. <laughs> Step three. Three. <laughs> Guys, this is a part of the short shift that obviously Reese received. He has loosened these with an allen key and then this goes down here in the space what we just took out. so we're going to watch him just do it oh your hands are big i can't even see give them a minute bro <laughs> no shit no, no. oh could you imagine that is so awkward how to lose a short shift there we go in like that right so basically oh god it oh it moves out the way yeah it like slots in perfect as you can see so now we're going to tighten it up am i right yep yeah we're going to tighten it up <laughs> and then um yeah so then we'll be with you with step four, four. <laughs> right so reese is tightening them up so it's all tight and it's definitely secure just in case it wants to come off him and then next step mm, so this is the other side of the short shifter so it obviously comes like attached and dead tight and so you have to like loosen it with the allen key mm -hmm. to fit around your actual gear stick. So it's like that now. So Reese is going to obviously, he's going to put it to his height how much he wants. As high but, as possible. So what does that mean? What does high mean? The highest is the shortest throw. So obviously that originally down there is your throw down there. Right, okay. So the closer you have it to that, the longer the throw, the higher up the shorter. Right, okay, so you all get that. So basically, Reese wants to the higher the shorter. Just before the bend, yeah. Yeah, so basically, when he's going sick, he's going to reverse as well. <laughs> so you just tighten it up. You can get any cord. Quick shifter, couldn't you? Yeah, you're not going to see are you? I know, but it's just nice to be colourful. You went boring with black. So this, you tie it up now so you definitely can't move it. Yeah. So that'll be a bit scary, wouldn't it? What number Alan key was that? Four, four mil. So four mil? I'm not sure if they vary with different makes, so I'm guessing that will be four mil. Oh, I see. Yeah. 
you tighten them. Yep, so that is uh, step five? four completed. Four completed on to five. On to five now. <laughs> right, let's get in there. Yeah. So the linkage that I popped to the side, which is now popping back over. If you can get in there. Hmm. Put like clips. Getting in there, guys. You should show that. Yep. Don't ask about a tattoo, guys. Yeah, the one who's 50. Oh, that was the <laughs> There you go. So, it's clipped it back over as you can hear it, or you would have heard it. It's like tight there. Yep. So, and it looks like it's, yeah you're back in perfect and obviously you've clipped it back on as well now yeah. so yeah just like double check you can definitely mm -hmm. everything back on perfectly yeah. you happy with that put it, all back together. We'll put it back together and have a look yes we will yeah, that's right. where's your little casing i think they're really ugly like cases on the room it looks like a wizard's hat the awkward part. <laughs> Spin it round. Tighten that up. <laughs> that's, that's the wrong way, isn't it? <laughs> oh, what are you doing? Clip that back in. Oh, Definitely back in that, yeah. yeah. Perfect. Happy? Sweet. Yeah, yeah, happy days. So that's all the steps now completed. Obviously, we just have to go and take it now for a quick test drive. Yeah. Test drive is on. You just, you just like find any excuse or don't you to like drive the car. Yeah, happy days. So he is testing out the product. Product test. Okay guys, so test one on the main road. Any excuse to drive it like in like it's supposed to be driven. <laughs> happy? Product, does it work? Yeah, good. Do a review, quick. What do you mean? A product review. What do you think of the product? Yeah, brilliant. <laughs> Guys, go and buy one. Obviously, one of the cheapest mods. How much was it? Like, I think you can get them like 30 to 60 quid, depending on which brand you go with. Okay, well, mine's 70 quid. Yeah, because you have to actually take the earbuds. Yeah. But anyway, guys, yeah, it's around that price. Um. So yeah, it's a cheap mod and obviously this one is from Airtech Motorsport, Auto Specialist. So the link is below to that. If obviously you do want to buy one, just go and buy one. It's definitely worth it. So yeah. Happy? Happy. So keep liking, keep subscribing, keep commenting. There is more fit fitting videos coming very, very soon for the RS. So we're all really happy. So yeah, so keep subscribing guys. I'll see you all very soon. Do <laughs>